Hey guys, today I'm going to be talking about DirectX 12 and what's going to happen at the end of the 7th generation. Well, technically the end is already here, but I'm talking about the end when the servers are literally shut down and stuff. So let's get to it. By the way, enjoy the Battlefield 4 gameplay. If you want to know the type of capture card I use, it's Roxio Game Capture HD. So, yeah, PS3 gameplay. Um, so DirectX 12 I've heard from many people on YouTube uh, it's going to basically improve the Xbox One's uh, power by 50% uh, I don't know how that's gonna work but I keep hearing it uh, I know it's definitely going to help the uh, game developing for the Xbox One um, I really hope that we can actually start to see 1080p games like Battlefield. Battlefield especially, because Battlefield is becoming more popular, and Call of Duty is starting to get a, uh, a little less popular. So, yeah. I mean, it's weird that Battle or Titanfall can run at 1080p on the 360, and it, like, runs at... 720p on the Xbox One. It's just weird. And then the frame rate on the 360 is a steady 30 frames per second, but on the Xbox One, it's 60 frames sometimes. Not all the times. Sometimes. My friend, the Rain22, I have a link down to his channel down in the description. He told me that he got to play Titanfall at GameStop, and uh, um, he. Well, while he was playing the game, it dropped down to one frame per second. So, yeah. Also, the DirectX 12 is also going to improve the graphics. I've seen a couple pictures. I'm not going to put them up in the video right now, mainly because I don't want to get a copyright notice. Though, I've probably already gotten a copyright notice, because I already have a song at the beginning of the video. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. So the next thing I want to talk about is the completely end of the 7th generation. Now, if you've watched a couple of my videos, you know that there's a way to play online for free, and it's called Excellent Kai, and I actually use Excellent Kai a lot. I like to play on the original Xbox with Halo 2, though Halo 2 I've overdosed on it for some reason. I love playing it on Excellent Kai. Excellent Kai is a service that allows you to system link games through the internet but your internet connection has to be really good uh, right now it allows you to use uh, xbox ps2 gamecube uh, 360 and ps3 and the psp um, the original xbox is the most popular but i have a feeling when these servers shuts down when these servers for the 360 and the PS3 shut down, it's gonna get full pretty fast. Especially because when that happens, there's gonna be tutorials, a lot more people are gonna be knowing about it. And yeah, also when the PSN went down, and I, th I think it was like March 2011, uh, Excellent Kai was used a lot for like the, the weeks it was down. Uh, Black Ops was the game at the time that was most popular, so that's what people played, and it works. Uh, uh, the, the cool thing is about system linking with Call of Duty games is that everything's automatically unlocked for you, because most likely if you're system linking, you don't have an inter internet connection, so everything's unlocked for you, because it's unfair to the people who don't have an internet connection to be able to play and not be able to kill other people and not rank up so yeah I think the this generation is gonna last a little bit more I'm gonna be upset especially uh, when they shut the 360 and the PS3 servers down when because GTA 5 
like GTA 4 is just as popular and GTA 5 there's so much stuff you can do in the online now I would like to see a patch somehow I don't think they're gonna do it but I would just like to see this if there was like a patch that if the both of the consoles used regular internet like the Wii like the Wii does I'm not sure if the Wii U does it but I know for a fact the Wii does uh, it's called Wii Broadband Internet Connection, I think. I, I don't know. But, um, yeah. I mean, there's it would probably get full of modders, but, hey, you know, it's better than nothing. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the Battlefield 4 gameplay. Uh, it's on the PS3. And, um, my gold expires on May 15th, so you're going to probably be seeing a lot of... PS3 gameplay, especially on the Grand Theft Auto on the PS3. So, yeah, I did get it for PS3. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, and favorite. You know it doesn't hurt, especially if you're signed in. So why don't you go ahead, stop being lazy, even though that was a hypocritic thing for me to say, and go down there and hit the like button. And while you're at it, subscribe. So, thanks for watching.